What's up, you two? My name is Tyler Rose, and welcome back to Tyler Rose TV, man. Let's go, man. Never gonna strike me, even if it did, they ain't never quite like me. That ain't like me, that ain't pretty like me. Now what's up YouTube, my name is Tyler Rose If you're new here and you into kicks, man Make sure you hit the subscribe button Give me a thumbs up And give me a comment down below if you love your mama You know how it goes, man For the returning subscribers that's watching If you already subscribed, welcome back, man We are so close to hitting 1,000 right now This video, I think I got 996 as I'm recording this video So we got 4 more subscribers away from 1K I'm very excited about that But nonetheless, I got a couple things I want to get into guys Before I start the video Now guys, for one, if you guys like this show Shirt I'm wearing this is the Born Winner shirt. Born Winner shirt is down below in the description at bornwinnersclothing.com. Go ahead and cop some merch. And guys, also if you're looking for another place to buy shoes, check out Mass Kicks down below in the description. And I have a promo code. So if you're on the site and you find some fire on the site, which you should, because they got some fire. When you find something you like on the site, and go ahead and buy it. Head to the cart. Use my promo code Rose TV, and you will get free shipping. Also, guys, one more thing before we get into the video. You know we're doing a giveaway once we hit 2,000 subscribers. So we're doing a giveaway guys 2,000 subscribers giveaway we're giving away a pair of Air Jordan 1's all you got to do is like this video subscribe to my channel hit the bell give me a thumbs up head over to Instagram follow me at Tyler Rose Music and then once you're done with that go ahead and type done and then you enter the raffle to win a free pair of Jordan's but enough of that man let's get into the video now what's up people as you know there's been so many dope releases the past couple of days i mean come on guys we got the mocha ones we got the off-white fives we got the calcite 380s man i mean the list goes on we got the freddy krueger air max 95s dropping soon so guys for the sneaker community for the sneaker heads whatever you want to call yourself we got a lot of heat dropping and i'm very excited about it so guys let me know down below if you copped anything if you hit on any of the raffles let me know what you got and where you copped it from so enough for that but guys you know the nike dunk has regained a lot of popularity within the last couple of years and when i say the dunk i mean the dunk not even the sbs but dunks in general a lot of people are giving credit for the dunks regaining popularity to virgil and travis scott and many other style influencers but guys i ain't gonna lie y'all man i've been a dunk fan i even have a couple pairs of dunks from like way back in the day not even sb dunks but just regular dunks that's somewhere in storage so i've always been a big fan of the dunks nonetheless man we got a Another dope dunk colorway coming out and these is flames bro these are called the Veners and this is a heat alert for sure and the best part about these bro they retail at a hundred dollars bro so oh my god you know how much money you can save by copping a hundred dollar shoe retail I mean that's a steal that's, that, that's a steal man but guys I could talk about the price all day because I love saving money and I love getting dope shoes but nonetheless let's get into the history of this shoe so the Nike Vena dunk is not the first time it's ever came Came out back in 2001 the ugly duckling nike dunk pack came out right and it had the Wiener sbs in it and it had the plum sbs in it which actually came out in february of 2020 this year already but this time november 11th guys we got the Wiener sbs coming out now just think about this man this is 2001 you got the ugly duckling pack there's something about a shoe that already came out retro the nostalgic feeling of it like you think about you think about 2001 you're sitting back at home you're watching the fast and the furious when the fast and furious series was still good you go to the mall you wear your dunks you're trying to show them off there's no IG guys so you gotta show off your fit by going in public and going to an actual place where other people are I mean what a time to be alive man I love the nostalgic feeling of shoes but man I can go on for days about that nonetheless let's get back on topic now these shoes guys I really like I am definitely gonna cop them even if I gotta pay resale price I want these shoes really bad I'm hoping I hit on a raffle but nonetheless it wouldn't be a Tyler Rose TV video without the T Rose detail now let's get into the detail of the shoe so these have some really nice quality to them we got that classic nike suede on these joints now the vena dunks consist of brown which nike describes as vena purple in which nike is calling a deep purple and green in which nike is calling autumn green now let's get into the side of the shoe and dive in so these dunks have that upper brown mesh around the heel of the shoe and we got that smooth nike swoosh and purple suede following the back of the swoosh we got green suede brown suede and green suede again now the toe box on these has brown suede surrounding the toe box is that smooth smooth crispy green suede around it now the midsoles on these is white then the soles is a full solid purple and for the laces we got that deep purple color under that is that brown mesh again and also on the heel of these shoes we got that classic nike logo 
with purple suede and in green embroidery is the Nike word. Following again that brown mesh. Now for the insoles, we got that Shrek Swamp Green. Now Nike didn't call it Shrek Green, but this is Tyler Rose TV, so we can make up our own colors. This look like a Shrek Swamp Green to me, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it that. So guys, nonetheless, I know I keep talking about these shoes because I love them so much. Let me know down in the comments what you think about these. Are these a cop? Are these a drop? Are these a flop? What are your thoughts? Please let me know down below. As y'all know, I always answer all my comments, man. I try my best to. I'm pretty sure I answer all of them unless I don't see it. But I definitely try to answer them for the most part. Now, if you're looking to cop these shoes, you definitely came to the right place. So I'm going to help you try to get these shoes. I want these myself. So I'm definitely going to keep my eyes peeled. I'm trying to get these, bro. I love these shoes so much. Like these are probably my favorite dunks of the year. I'm not even kidding with you guys. I don't care if they're not SBs. These are dope. These are freaking dope. I want these. All right, all right. I gotta get back on topic, guys. Get carried away. I'm so passionate because I want these shoes so bad, bro. Like I want them so bad. These. Are, uh. All right. So first and foremost, these officially release November 11th, according to the Nike sneakers app. I do know people personally who already got early access to them. And it says they got them. I only had early access to one pair of shoes on the Nike sneakers app and I didn't want them. So I don't even know how that works. Nike sneakers app is definitely one place to cop these. Keep your eyes peeled on raffles, 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 because there's going to be a lot of raffles that are going to have these. So of course we got the sneakers app. I always say in my videos, make sure you download the sneakers and stuff app. So the sneakers and stuff app had the Calcite 380s. They had the Mocha 1s, which is a couple of pairs of shoes that are dropping either today or tomorrow, depending on when I put this video out. It probably already been dropped, but nonetheless, the app had both of those. I only entered into the Mocha ones, even though I did like the Calcite 380s a lot, a lot because of the glow. I'd rather have the Mocha ones because I don't even have any more ones anymore in my collection because I got rid of a lot of my shoes back in the day. So I definitely want to get my ones back up because I've always been a fan of the ones. As I told y'all before, in 2010, when I was only 15 years old, I had a ones collection. I had like good six, seven pairs, but this is before ones were big and hype. I just like the shoe. But back on topic, if you're looking to cop the shoes, keep your eyes peeled. Like I said, check your sneaker websites, check your sneaker news, check your kicks on fire. Make sure you follow all the pages on Instagram that talk about shoes and releases and make sure you check out bodega as well but nonetheless guys thank you for watching like i said this has been the best month of growth so far in my youtube career i'm so thankful for y'all watching i'm glad you like my videos i'm glad we're starting to form this community man make sure you go ahead and hit the subscribe button make sure you enter the raffle you know the rules to that check out mass kicks check out my website and until next time i'm gonna see y'all make sure y'all wash your hands make sure you take care of yourself i'm gonna see y'all next time man peace